Hey guys, Dane Van Emden here. Welcome to another video. Today we are in Darling Point and I'm gonna take you on a tour of an enormous dual level apartment with beautiful city and Harbour Bridge views. The apartment has three bedrooms, four bathrooms, 446 square metres of living area and garaging for four vehicles. Before we start, I'd like to thank Bill Maloof and Margaret Morossi of LJ Hooker Double Bay for having us through today. Okay guys, let's go take a look. As you enter into this apartment, you get your first impression of the space and it's a pretty good one. You'll notice that the sheer size of it, first of all, it's a massive foyer. Over here, you've got a big grand staircase that leads down to the lower level. And when you do walk into this space, it almost feels like you've walked into a big grand mansion. It's really quite incredible. Some of the features in this space are these beautiful hardwood floors, which are set in a herringbone pattern, and they actually run all the way through the living areas on this top level. Uh, other things in this area are these beautiful wall panels, which help to give it that classic style. If you want to follow me down this way, I'll take you through to the main living area. And as you can see, this is a big, beautiful space. It has that same timber that's flowed all the way through from the lobby. Also the same wall panels that give it that classic style. But the thing that makes it a modern apartment are these beautiful big windows that let all the light in. And classic homes don't really have this feature in particular. So that's where they've blended beautifully, the modern and the classic. As you can see, it lets in all the light. You can see the incredible view. You've got the bridge, the city, the harbour, a bit of the opera house. And uh, that's a really amazing feature in this space. The other thing I did want to show you is the ceiling. You can see a decorative bulkhead, which is around the edge. And there's actually uh, your ducted air conditioning, down lights, and even integrated sound all mounted into the ceiling here. That bulkhead also gives the ceiling a bit more height and a bit more depth, which is really cool. Heading out onto the terrace, you'll notice how big this space is. It's quite a large area and it has enough room for a table. You could have a barbecue down one end. It's a really, really nice spot to sit and probably have a lot of your dinners here throughout most of the year because the weather is always so nice here in Sydney. If you want to follow me back down through the living room, I just want to show you really quickly this little space off to the side here. This is the dining room. I just wanted to quickly show you this wall of mirrors on this side, which helps to make the space feel a lot larger than it actually is, but it also brings all of that light in that's coming through this window, which leads out onto its own little balcony. And you'd be sitting here having your formal dining with a view of the Harbour Bridge and the Opera House. That's pretty cool. Now, if you come across the hallway from the dining space, you actually enter the kitchen. This kitchen is very well sized. And as you can see, it's got the same timber floors that are in the rest of the living areas. I like that they've matched the cabinetry to the wall panels in the living areas too. They've used a beautiful black granite for the bench tops and the splashbacks. All of the appliances are stainless steel, tapware's chrome. It's all very nice and neutral. And it's the caliber of kitchen that you'd expect in a property like this. On the rest of this level, you have an additional two bathrooms and another large bedroom, which includes a big open plan study area. So coming down onto the lower level of the apartment now, this is more of a casual level. You've got two bedrooms, two bathrooms, you've got another kitchen slash butler's pantry, and then you follow the hallway all the way down into this incredible living space. And it's quite a large room, same as upstairs. The only difference really is that they've got some shelving on this side and over on this side, they've got a beautiful gas fireplace with a marble hearth and a TV mounted above that. It's got the same terrace outside, beautiful big open windows, lots of glass, and also that incredible view. So let's head back down this way now. If we take a left off the hallway, we head into the master bedroom. This room, as soon as you walk in, you just feel the warmth. You've got that sun coming in. It's the afternoon right now, westerly sun. Beautiful linen wrapped walls. This whole room is wrapped in linen, which is very luxurious. I wanna particularly talk about these light fixtures. These are beautiful pendant lights. 
Uh, they're a chain mesh, really, really nice. And that blends the modern with the classical. The other thing to mention about this master bedroom is that it does have its own balcony. And from this balcony, and even most of the bedroom, you do get a really amazing view straight over to the Harbour Bridge and the top half of the Opera House. Another thing to mention about this complex is this amazing pool behind me, 12 metre heated saltwater pool, mostly indoors, but also has this little outdoor section. And this complex only has a couple of neighbours, so you pretty much have it yourself most of the time. Well, that's it for today's tour, guys. If you like what you saw, be sure to hit the like and subscribe button and do check out our other videos. And with that, we'll see you on the next tour.